Hey, welcome back to my channel, Loving Your Life with Mama D. And today we're going to be trying out some Beyond Steak. We've heard a lot about it and I just want to see how it tastes for myself. So we're going to start up heating a, a skillet uh, with some olive oil. And then we're going to pour the Beyond Steak right into that skillet and just begin to heat it and toss them around until they are done. Now I'm going to use uh, the Blue Bonnet plant-based butter and I'm going to put it into a small skillet, about one tablespoon, and make gravy for the beef. In the meantime, keep your eye on the beef because it could stick or get overdone. Now I'm putting about a heaping tablespoon of flour in with the butter and um, just let that cook down and then we're going to kind of brown it and again continue to stir your beef now go ahead and start to stir the butter and that flour together so it will be blended add a little granulated garlic and then still keep your eye on that beef and then make sure that that butter is melting down so that you can make the gravy. I'm not gonna make it fancy at all. I'm not using any um, uh, onions and all that. Uh, I'm just gonna use the flour, the garlic, and maybe a little extra seasoning, and that will do uh, for the gravy. And they're starting to brown. Uh, very nice caramel brown colors coming forth. Keep that beef stirred. Now add the gravy onto the beef and just let it simmer. Now I'm adding one bag of frozen broccoli. Toss it around and it will cook just within a few minutes. Now give it a nice little stir and then you want to place the lid on it and let it steam for a little while. And then I actually uh, tasted a little bit and it seemed like it needed just a little more salt. So I added a dash of a Himalayan uh, seasoned salt. And then I added some Tabitha Brown Sunshine Seasoning, just to give it a little extra kick. Stir it up again, and notice that your broccoli is are pretty much done after about three or four minutes, or however long it takes for you to get them the, you know, the doneness or the tenderness that you prefer. But it actually looked absolutely fantastic. Now I decided to serve uh, the beef and broccoli over a bed of rice. I had already prepared it in our steamer. And there you have it. Now it looks absolutely delicious, but when I tasted it, the meat was chewy like rubber. Now normally I demonstrate myself eating and enjoying the food, but when I tasted this beef, I was very disappointed. So this is my honest review. Out of a 1 to 10, I would give it about a 3. Alright, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Have a good day.